Hello everyone. Um, our lesson today is um, is a non-verbal reasoning um, lesson, and it's type four, and it's a code breaker. As you can see, I've got some shapes there, and I've got some codes. Okay, see so this one that means there is a relationship between those codes and the shapes. Now, what I need to do, I need to find the relationship first before I can try to find my answer. So, how do I do that? So, I look at the codes which are the same. For instance, on here, I have got an F there and an F there. So this tells me that those two um, shapes in there and shapes in there, they are, good, they are similar in a way or the other. But when I look at them, they've got all a big circle with them. So which means F is a big circle. Big black first, so there's a black circle there. Because it's shaded as well. And that's where they're exactly the same. So I've got my F. Now I'll move to the second letter. I have got an X there and an X there. Where are those two similar? Those two shapes in there, shapes in there, where are they similar? They all have a one star. So which means X is one star. But on there, I've got three stars. So which means it's the same as this. So which means Z is three stars. So my answer for the first one would be A. FZ. Okay, let's try our next one. I have got, so what I do first is looking for the same letter so that at least I can work out the relationship from there. So on here, I've got a P there and a P there. Where are they the same? They all have a square outside. The big shape outside is a square. So that's why, that's where they're exactly the same. Now, if I look here, I've got a circle outside. So which means it's the same as this, which is W. So, which means my W is the outer circle. Okay, now let's move to the next one. Uh, we have got an M there and an M there as the second letter. As you can see, M and M, it means the star is unshaded. So, the one I'm looking for is shaded, but it is striped like this. So, which means the second letter would be S. So, S. It means shaded, a shaded plus, okay, which is the same shading. So my answer here will be WS, which is B. So on here, the answer would be B. Okay, now let's move to the last one on our practice. On here, I have got a Z and a Z there. Why are these two similar? They've got an arrow pointing the same direction. So that's where they are similar. Now on here, my arrow is pointing down. So which one is similar to this? It's this one. So which means the first letter will be T. T, which means arrow down. I'll just say a, a down arrow, a pointing down arrow. Okay, so the arrow is just pointing down. Now let's move to the next one. Where do we have a similar same letter? We have got an M there and an M there, which means an M is similar in a way. Okay. So can you see we've got one triangle, which is shaded. On there, we've got two. So two, which means it's this one. So which means this one, we've got two, we've got two, which means it's S. So that one, so the S, which means it's for the black triangle, two black triangles. Okay, which means my answer would be TS, so I've got a TS, which is E. So on here, my answer would be E. As usual, worksheet is at the end of this video. Practice it and send in your work for marking so that you can do the next lesson.